situation. Samson side by side. Refrigerator. Model is RSG257A AARS. Issue that I was having is that the freezer was not getting cool enough, no matter what I uh, set the temperature to. You can see I had to take all the food out because of the food spoil, the ice that was in here. Move, physically remove the ice before it was puddles on the floor. I needed to clean the condenser coils. I didn't have the condenser brush, which you can purchase from Home Depot, but I took uh, some condensed air, blew it. Uh, after I blew it with the condensed air, I took my vacuum cleaner and used the vacuum cleaner to suck up much dust. Rule of thumb, if the condenser is on, fan should be on, always. If that condenser is on, and you hear it on, but that fan is not on, that's your problem. It, the, the condenser fan helps keep the condenser cool. Knowing that my condenser is working, my fan is working, whatever problems could it be. The condenser needs uh, Freon, which is R134A. My unit uh, is low on Freon. As you can see, I purchased these adaptive fittings uh, from the auto parts store, Advance. And then I have my uh, AC line which is also uh, connected to the refrigerant, the Freon, which this Freon is R134A. Flip this upside down and check. I'm going to do a burst. And as you can tell, there's a change in the condenser. I'm going to do another burst. What I've noticed is that when I added Freon, the freezer got really cool, really cold condensation um, that was in the freezer is now gone again this is the F Samsung RSG 257AARS uh, which experienced the uh, issue with the freezer not cooling uh, there was no errors uh, codes on the front because if you're low on Freon you're not going to get any error codes but